When I first started my page, I just wanted to share cleaning tips because I was a housekeeper and I knew about this topic a lot. But as time passed, I realized that a lot of people were never taught how to clean properly or even shown how to do it or even taught what products to buy or what were the best ones. And that is why I love making videos about how to clean things and what products are my favorite because look, I'm a professional house cleaner and I think I have a thing or two to show you. So if you can and you want to, tell me down below your favorite hack or cleaning tip that you have learned from me. And the proof is in the pudding because in the last 40 seconds, I just taught you how to clean your glass doors like a pro. I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to give her the benefit of the doubt because I feel like she did it correctly in the beginning. She just did it as a homeowner or as a you know homeowner housekeeper where she didn't. We would have looked to me like that was Dawn maybe or some sort of detergent in the bucket. And yeah. she... And she applied it on, and then she squeegeed it off, which is all you'd really need to do. Oh, come on, Bobby. There's other things in there that was so wrong. Well, I mean, I'm, I'm giving her a benefit of the doubt that that... You don't use a scrub pad on window. You don't use a scrub pad on glass. That's right. But it looked to me like it was three... <laughs> well, I was assuming that scrub pad was on the other side in her hand. I was giving her all these benefits of the doubt, right? So... Well, I was wondering... I was wondering why she threw the squeegee on the floor the minute on the opening scene there because, you know. I, and then, I, and then I mean, she didn't use it anymore after that. No, she squeegeed the window. I think there's three different uh, three different videos there. and She does three different <laughs> processes all at the same time. Because well, she, started started her, with the, she started out with the I don't think you had to do all three of those things. <clears throat> no, listen, she, she did the squirt and the squeegee. Okay, she did that right. And then she did a spongy and uh, wiped it with her hand or with something. Oh, now, wait a minute, Don. She did not wait, use that wait. squeegee right. I don't, I don't, well, the technicalities are irrelevant. Oh, my point is she did three different processes. She did one with just the soap and the squeegee. The next one, she did some kind of cleaner with a sponge. And then the oh. third one, she used an aerosol can. Right. Yeah. There was three different ways of cleaning that window in that one video. And used way too much of all of them. <laughs> oh, yeah. I mean, it was. I mean, again, I agree with Bobby. It's a happy homeowner doing. I, I have people call me all the time and say, "How do I do this? How do this?" And I'm, when you I tell them how to clean windows, they go, "Really?" I said, "Yeah, a little detergent." Okay, so let, let's listen to the professional cleaner here, right? <laughs> go for it, Miguel. Oh, yeah. Tell me how to do it, Javier. <laughs> Javier. <laughs> well, first of all, there's absolutely no need. I have never used, nor probably would ever use. I don't need aerosol foam to to clean a, a window. I mean, that's just that is. I mean. Okay. Yes, it'll do the job. I've noticed that before. First of all, that I don't, I don't particularly like using aerosols anyway. Uh, it, it's I think it streaks up the window. It's not. It doesn't necessarily, you know, do any any particular good a good type of thing for a small window like that. Yes, the idea of a small squeegee, you could. But like Dave, going back to Dave said before, the 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 using the squeegee was you know she was using it incorrectly. But okay, fine. Like. You know, we'll give her the benefit of the doubt in that. But I mean, it's just, it's so simple that you could just get a microfiber towel and get some H docs, <laughs> a little bit of the right dilution, <laughs> and just go down to, and with a dry towel, come right back on it, or flip your towel, and the glass is beautiful. It's perfect. I know we do it all probably. the time. I don't have any yeah. issues. <laughs> microfiber probably with water most of the time, or with water, Bobby. Yeah. Exactly. That's another thing too. Is water. Sometimes you don't need the solution cleaners for, for glass. Especially on the inside glass, because that's just usually, you know, foggy film and some dust. On the, if it's an outside glass, you might have to do a little bit more because it's got... Right, right, exactly. With, with outside, because you've got the elements outside and all that stuff, right? So I could even I could even see where you want a squeegee outside or, you, you know, it's yeah. more understandable. But uh, squeegee... Uh, yeah. <laughs> well, gentlemen, I, I tell you... I, I, so I what kind of score we give this? As a as a well, I give her a. Do we have a one one out of ten or ten? One out of ten. One out of ten. I give her an eight, a seven or an eight. Yeah, sure. You know, right no, idea. No, you can't go seven or eight. It's seven point okay, three. Seven point three. It's like Portnoy's pizza. Seven, you know? seven so my two. point is this, gentlemen. Seven people one. see people right, see this, that. and the words they hear yeah, is she's a professional cleaner. Now, the yeah. thing is, we also know we're talking, <coughs> there is a difference between residential and commercial. We get that. But the thing here is, is this the way people learn to do things? And, and I think this is whenever you put out a video and you're touting that you're a professional, you might need to actually qualify that with an education course rather than just doing what every other household owner is doing, right? Every house owner is spraying the window with way too much 
using any rag and spending all this time leaving streaks. I'm feeling a Papa Don video coming on. Ooh. <laughs> Talking clean in a dirty world. Talking clean in a dirty world.